I had music as a subject in school, so it was the most logical thing to go and do after school, but I had this wild dream of being a farmer. Some of my best childhood memories were spending time with our grandparents on their farm in the Karoo, and I just couldn't shake that, so I had to somehow act on it. I grew up in the Windlands, so I was surrounded by vineyards, and it seemed to be a way of being involved with farming, so I decided to study winemaking. I kept missing music though, so I kept on taking lessons and I got to a point where I, I really had a desire to marry the two. So I got involved with the Street Children Project. If I could marry the wine and the story and the music into something that gives pleasure to me, but that, that also improves someone else's life. So I decided to name the wine Cecilia because my, my grandmother was Cecilia and I got her name, so my middle name is Cecilia as well. And Cecilia is also the patron saint of musicians. In the process of looking for a vineyard for Cecilia, I came across an old vine or an old bush vine Pinotage vineyard in the Clay William Hills uh, on the other side of the Skurfberg. I was looking for a special vineyard and that one was it. It was old, it had a very low yield, and it made a wine which I still today think has got all the best attributes of Pinotage. We started sponsoring small projects, but I got to a point where I was really frustrated. I wanted to do more and I wanted to see, you know, see more happen through the wine. And towards the end of last year, we established a foundation, Cecilia Foundation. A percentage of the sales of each bottle is transferred into the foundation and from there we employ a teacher and she rotates between different entities in, in the community. So she's at two of the schools where there's no music education at the moment and then she's at daycare centres as well. What I found was that music, it can solve so many problems, especially in the lives of children. A teacher told me about one of the girls that she wasn't good in sport, but when she started to sing in the choir, it gave her a sense of purpose. It just boosted her confidence in such a nice way. What I hope in future is that we can do more in the area of showing how uh, music can alleviate some of the issues around fetal alcohol syndrome.